Um, so our robber got more than he bargained for when he targeted Kelly Lake Convenience last month. I'm sure we're all familiar with Kelly Lake Convenience right on the corner of Kelly Southview Lake and, and Kelly Lake. Southview, exactly. <clears throat> yeah, you go through the stop sign, stop, of course, yeah. and then you go to Kelly Lake Convenience. So when the cops showed up, they asked the guys, where are you hurt? And he said, I'm hurting everywhere. Uh, and that was a witness that, that uh, the thief uh, was saying that. And that's because he kind of got his butt kicked mm -hmm. after trying to rob the store with a knife. So the article says, The 40-something Korean woman who operates the store with her husband, uh, one so Kim, uh, is of small stature and famously friendly. Mm -hmm. She has a sweet, buoyant nature. But little did the man know, she could also be a fierce warrior. Oh, my. So an, a female customer who had exited ahead of him would not re only return, but prove to be equally fearless. And she, she, he also did not clearly uh, count on the appearance of Kim, who served in the military oh, man. and knows a few martial arts moves. Oh, no. This just gets better and you better. You know what? They probably have a surveillance camera in there, and that would be, that would be really Where cool. is this video? I know. We will play it on it. That <laughs> would go viral for sure. Exactly. I just think that's awesome. So, Wow. Um, you know, she said, I just had this intuition, a spidey sense, and it turned out to be correct. And she heard screams coming from inside um, as as the man uh, pulled out the knife and was going uh, going with this. So he oh, had a man. big hunting knife and, uh, you know, she's just screaming and she's not sure what's going to happen. But it ended up okay. I really hope we can get the video for that. The Let's video... hope that the closed circuit cameras were on. Yeah, so probably I would hope that CTV Northern Ontario uh, News at noon would have that. Yeah, definitely so, stay tuned. I'm excited to see this. We'll see if we can get the footage uh, from that. That, that. That'd be incredible. Like, yeah. We'll post it on YouTube if it's not already. That's right. And just around this house, it says, Kim, like all Korean men, had a compulsory stint in the Korean military in his Man. youth. He became adept at Taekwondo and Kung Fu, earning a black belt oh, in man. Kung Fu. He even coached martial arts before they emigrated to Canada 15 years ago. And uh, I just think this is an absolutely awesome story. It, uh, it, it it riles me up, gets me excited. You know, I feel, I actually feel sorry for the person. That no, you don't. I, I kind of do. Can you imagine two people knowing, you know, martial arts to that extent with that kind of background? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anyways, yeah. Anyways, they held him. They got him. more than they bargained for. So, yeah, they held him there for the police. They pulled off his mask and uh, they said, I want to see what you look like. <laughs> oh, man. So we can tell the cops. Oh, wow. And uh, they just wanted to hold him until they got there. So so they did. They held him there until, yeah, until the police got there. Yeah, this is such an episode. Wow. I am just, yeah. We got to find out more about this and, you know, come on with a follow-up tomorrow. This is this is really exciting. Um you know, there is something about standing up for yourself, uh, but you need to have the ability to do that, right? Yeah. Like I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend the average person to do what they did. No. However, they had the ability, the knowledge, to to be able to combat something like that, and right? The, and the 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 determination. Determination. I mean, for that sure. is just subdued him until the police came like oh that's impressive that's that's really just so cool. all you robbers know this <laughs> is not right. an easy that's not target a, that's not a story you want to go to not that we would encourage you to ever do It'd that be cool if they were able to train all the other store owners <laughs> yeah. in town start yeah. a new taekwondo kung fu yeah that would be awesome yeah i mean it i'm really happy no one got hurt for sure I'm relieved yeah. um but it's an absolutely uh awesome story and uh, we'll see. Yeah, we'll see how this pans out. I'd mm -hmm. love to get some footage. Definitely gotta get the footage, even if it's some uh, you know shaky footage.